Hey there, it's me, Minatsuki Man. Today we're going to be going over the MSO6 Zaku 2. The Principality of Zeon's main mobile suit during the early to mid stages of the One Year War. Arguably, a symbol of their ingenuity and strength. The Zaku 2 had a fairly rough start in regards to its development. The MSO 6A Zaku 2, or the A type, was barely an upgrade from its predecessor, the MSO 5 Zaku 1. Its performance and equipment seemingly resembled that of the Zaku 1, deeming it inadequate for wide mass production. After its first trials, the A type was redrafted into a more suitable version, the MSO 6C, or C type, Zaku. The C type was a complete overhaul in relation to the A type. The 105mm machine gun was upgraded to a more powerful 120mm model. An optional 280mm bazooka became widely available for the Zaku 2, allowing it to become a lethal adversary against space warships. The C type also had a fixed mounted shield attached to its right shoulder and ramming spikes welded to its left. These additions made the C type much more versatile on the battlefield and gave the Zaku 2 an iconic appearance. The C-Type would finally seek legendary status at the Battle of Lone, where pilots such as Johnny Raiden, Shin Matsunaga, the Black Tristars, and the fabled Char Aznabal would make a name for themselves. The C-Type would eventually be replaced by its more streamlined successor, the MSO-6F or F-Type Zaku. This model would be slightly lighter and more maneuverable, though it would lack radiation shielding due to the banning of nuclear weapons in light of the One Year War. In all, the Zaku 2 not only proved to be the Principality's main weapon, its legacy lived on to carry the strength and essence of Xeon. Thanks for watching and please press the subscribe button for more videos in the future. For more information about the Zaku 2, check out the links below. And as always, may the glory of victory be yours. See you next time.